I have a lot of parts to replace. Walking away, your words are lost on me. It's taking everything not to turn around. Throw it away, see if you'll let go of me when you're not holding me. I can see it now. Hey, when I lose, but if I'm gonna lose you. I'm like, oh shit, I've been doing this a long time Lost in my head, I don't care, I'm not gonna lose it I'm not gonna lose this I'm up all day, all night, be playing our last fight Now in hindsight, I don't care, I'm not gonna lose it I'm not gonna lose this Yeah, kinda hate myself sometimes Everything was on the line Didn't want to be the one who had to say it No, I can't move one at a time Promise I'll put down my pride Don't look back because I mean it when I say it Here I have this fender ready to be painted. I have the gas tank. I just need to take a couple things off of it and it's ready to go to paint slash be uh, cleaned out. These items need to be replaced. There's a fan in there. All this is kind of just waiting to be cleaned and organized. And I haven't shown you guys the shed in a little bit. So I installed this window as uh, zero insulation. We got darts up, we got some nuts and bolts bins, I've got the toolboxes here, and this little pile right here are some of the parts going to powder coat. And then over here, an update, we have the engine. The engine's heads have been rebuilt as far as the valve train goes. The valves have been lapped and reinstalled. I have done a straight edge on the surface, make sure it's completely flat, and it is. And the only thing I have to do is put the valve covers on. However, I can't do that because the valve cover gaskets that I got uh, don't fit. So that's the last thing to do on the top end of the engine. Then there's a couple small things. I got to replace an O-ring back here. You can see this just moving around. Uh, I got to replace, there's a bracket right here I got to replace. It's in that pile. But other than that, the engine is pretty much ready to go. This water pump has a dowel that I need to replace and it's on its way. But this is the shed. This is the setup in the shed now. And over here, oh, I forgot to show you guys this. Yeah, my little shelf of explosive material. It should be in a box, but I don't have a box. And then I just installed a couple things that I use, uh, don't use, or don't really have a place for. Just hung them up. I mean, the weed eater gets used, and occasionally I have to restring it. And then I got my ladder right up here. These came at like a 45 degree angle these uh, brackets. But I was like, no, I don't need them at a 45 degree angle. I need them at a 90 degree angle. So I did. Got leaf blower, weed eater there, and another bracket for something. The front end, I haven't done much with. Uh, I left all my Allen wrenches at school. So as soon as I get my Allen wrenches, I'm going to pull this piece off. It's going to powder coat. And then this will be done. Well, this, that, the powder coating and that's the update. I hope you guys like the progress so far. I'm really excited to get this thing done and on the road and be able to ride it. And I hope you guys are too. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.
down in this cabinet we have a cat and these right here these are all the parts ready to go back on the bike they're cleaned done new ready to go that right there too that radiator I'm excited oh shit, I've been doing this a lot.